All right, welcome back. And next, we're going to do a trailer review. This is Uncle Dave's topic, and it is the Exorcist Believer movie trailer. Just waiting on this. The new Exorcist movie, and we're going to watch it right now. Good day. Hey, be home by dinner. I love you. Good morning, Mr. Fielding. Good morning, Catherine. And here are your daughters, Angela and Catherine. It's about seven hours ago, and that's the last information we have. Catherine! Angela! If you can hear this, we love you. Please come home. Hey. Hey, you found her? What are you and Catherine doing out there in those woods? You were just walking and walking. That's what I remember. Angela, can you tell your dad how long you were gone? Just a few hours. Baby, you've been gone three days. Went through, brought something back with him. The body and the blood of Jesus Christ. Body in the blood? Body in the blood? Catherine. Body in the blood. The body in the blood. The body and the blood. Catherine. The body and the blood. The body and the blood. Have you ever? seen anything like this on me no but there are people out there who have you have some experience with possession yes more than i'd like i believe you can help get our girls back exorcism is a ritual every culture every religion they all use different methods it's going to take all of them. Don't be scared. We've met before. Mother. This is uh, your topic. You you start us off. Okay, so this is my first watching the trailer. It was supposed to be a reaction from me, and um, <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. What's I'm, on I'm, your mind? I'm, I'm, I'm searching for words, man. I, it, average, maybe. <laughs> average, maybe. I mean. It, movie making people out there hear me when i say how can you take something that was already made already good and take it down a notch <laughs> my god man i mean somebody gave you all the keys you got you got the the original you got the blueprint. You, girl. You, got the you got the blueprint and everything man especially you got some black people talking about church <laughs> I didn't see no, not one black person shouting in that video. You know good and well, little black girl got today. <laughs> they, be, oh, geez, I mean, they be doing all that shit if they thought some black kid got possessed by the. I don't think it's possible. <laughs> but they make us go to church when we're young. But yeah, they be done gravel, hanging down. Like, Yo, <laughs> I, I will say. Oh, are you done? No, no yeah, please continue. Please. I will say this. I, I like the end of it. I like how they kind of. They kind of threw some, um, we call it, uh, they paid homage to the old, like, do you remember the old, or I don't remember, but I remember looking up, like, uh, The Exorcist when it first came out and, like, the trailers and stuff like that. 
And one of their old trailers, it had that type of scene uh, when the when it goes like black and white mm-hmm. or whatever. I, I think that I think they're trying to pay homage um, to, uh, to 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 the to the original Exorcist. Um, so I kind of like how they put that in there, and I like how like certain parts they like started that iconic music but didn't play. And then they stopped. The yeah, so they stopped, and I kind of I kind of I kind of like that. Um, because there's an art to making a trailer. Um, but outside of that, then yeah, it looks pretty typical. But I think some of the issue is, I mean, I mean, what more can you really do with yeah. that story? I, I'm not, I'm not really sure what, what you know, what can you really do? I, I, I see that they're, they're trying to be a little different, but like, okay, we're gonna have two girls possessed yeah. at the same time. Yeah. But I mean, at the end of the day, it's still the, you know, it's still kind of the same old trope. So I mean, I, I'm not really surprised, and it's probably not going to be, you know, uh, of any type of real substance. But I mean, you know, the, it, it, we we talked about this on the last podcast. I mean, they're just trying to rehash the things that they've done over and over again. It, it's an established uh, IP, and you know, it's probably just a, a cash grab at the end of the day. Yeah, I have to. My, I, my, 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 uh, my, my, I, I was first. My sentiments. Uh, you go right, Demetrius. My sentiments. Uh, you know what? Go ahead. Go ahead, Demetrius. <laughs> I mean, I, I, this movie would have been three seconds long. It was real black folks. Ass whooping the movie. <laughs> Especially that church, man. You got to lock the doors and everything. Oh, you know, you You've been in the woods for three, mother- <laughs> three days. <laughs> you probably wouldn't have lived past the beach. Yeah. What? <laughs> demons? You had demons? <laughs> I'm yeah, about to beat the demon out of you. I was what? like, oh, man, okay. she's walking down the church saying that. Okay. Yeah. You know what's you know kind of funny that you say that, Matundo, because the, the one part when, you know, the light flashes and she's kind of just staring at him. You know, I don't know what it is. It's, it's probably the demon, but there was like this look of disrespect, and I'm like, well, yeah. Oh, yeah. I was like, oh, 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 oh. you're not about to be looking. Are you at talking me? to like, me? Like, 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 are like, you oh. talking to me? Yeah. Like, <laughs> you know what? I'm, yeah. Like, if you don't get your, but you know, it is kind of funny that you brought that up because it's just, too? yeah. <laughs> well, I'll say this, guys. I think that I, my I, I my sentiments echoes uh, Johnny Mozzarella's. Uh, I think this is like, like, I will say this. The trailer was nicely crafted. I'll give him that. It's a decent trailer. I'm just not that interested. Like, I, I don't, there's not many places you can go with this. I think when they did, and I brought it up right here, it's called Exorcist The Beginning. And it was actually two movies. It's called Exorcist The Beginning and Exorcist Dominion. And I can't remember exactly what it was. Some, it, it was a few between the writer, director, or something like that. So they made, it's the same cast, and he made two different movies. And one's good and one's bad. And one of them was good, one of them was bad. And the 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 thing that they brought to it that was new and interesting though was that um it was something about where the devil landed on earth after he was cast out from heaven. And that's where like the first possession happened or something like that. And it was actually pretty interesting. I actually like the movie. But this right here, it just seems like okay, well, like John said, okay, this is the original movie, except instead of uh one girl is two girls. Instead of one white girl, there's a white girl and a black girl. Now, I think it would be interesting if they would have went the black route. It was a black girl or a black boy. That got I believe it would have been 2.5 seconds. Well, the reason why I think it would have been interesting is because... <laughs> she would have walked into the woods, and when she walked back out... Whoosh, whoosh, yeah, but they could have they could have tied it in more with, I don't know, something like um African spiritual uh, system mm-hmm. or something like that. Um, and make it yeah. or, origin of religion, tribal animism, something like that. You know what I'm saying? And how and maybe take it way back to like caveman days, motherfuckers getting possessed and shit like that. Right, or right. you could actually go and you look at the original Exorcist is supposed to be de- possessed by a demon from um Samaria. another re- Samaria called Pazuzu, Pazuzu, right? Yeah, but so when you look at but right, right, you, let me wait, fin- wait. Can, can can I finish talking? Don't we don't you always say that when you're talking? <laughs> Let me finish. Okay. Now, the idea is Pazuzu, back in those days, it's another demon that would possess children, and you call Pazuzu to get rid of that demon. It would be interesting if they actually looked at the real history and they had to call the demon to get rid of the demon. That would be interesting. Well, I'll say this. Um, when you look at Sumeria and that, that region, 
the Semitic regions. I mean, they share so many myths and concepts. I mean, uh, a lot of the Hebrew concept, concepts come out of um, um, the Canaanites and shit like that. So, so this idea that you know it's totally different, it, it's not. I mean, it, it, it came from cultural. Uh, uh, nobody said it was totally culture. different. Brian, you yeah. about to get us canceled? Huh? <laughs> you about to get us canceled? I ain't canceled. <laughs> seeing, seeing that the Hebrews took things that didn't belong to them. Well, it's not about taking things that didn't belong oh, yeah, to you. Yeah, that, I'm getting off or I lose my job. I didn't. Mm-hmm. Say, no, I didn't say that. He said that. I'm saying that. Not y'all. I'm saying, look at the with me. Look at the kids with me. I'm saying the Hebrews are just like any other culture. They borrow and they take from from cultures that are around them. Everyone does that. It's called what's it called? Is it even a term for it in um in uh anthropology? Stealing. Uh, yeah, we used to call it biting in the '80s. Well, well that's black people. Cause black people don't because black people think that we have a culture where we where we where we um where we frown upon what we call biting. But if you go to a place like Japan, they, they, they consider um, copying one of the highest for form, forms of, gra- of, uh, of almost- like Flattery. Flattery. Endearing. So, so no, so uh, what I guess what I'm saying is, is that, you know, that is, it made sense for them to use that particular demon or whatever they want. Oh, cultural more, assimilation. Cultural assimilation, yeah. They wanted something much more ancient than even what we would consider was, is in the Bible. So I thought that was actually pretty interesting that they use uh, P- Ponzuzu, Ponzuzu, whatever his name was in uh, the original Exorcist movie. But uh, let's move on to his name. Old... You better say his name right. <laughs> Me and you sleep. What do you think, Diego? Um, I just think that I'm hoping there's more like scenes where you're seeing like you know like you could like in the old exes and stuff you know there were some iconic type scenes that you like oh snap you yeah, know her. around <laughs> yeah and things like that I mean you know in this trailer it, it's just you know they're okay they're right by each other they're doing things or she's you know I think the, really the only thing kind of got to me was like she's walking in the church like that saying that like well I'm like okay you got all these people here so I'm gonna do something I mean I don't know I, I'm pretty sure there's probably more. <laughs> Scenes like you know those iconic sight scenes, but I like to see a new, the new twist on yeah, it. Yeah, but so, it's like it's, know, it's, it's like you know, I mean, you see one possession. Scenes, movie, you see them all. It's like ever since the Exorcist is there's been a plethora of possession movies that have come out. Some of them are good, some of them, are, yeah. most of them are horrible. But it's a to me, it's a dead genre. Like stop it. Like I'm tired of seeing them. But um, Carbon X. Yeah, yeah, this is one of the things you just basically yeah. trying to you know. Rehash the things here. Yeah, yeah. Carbon yeah. X. What, what was your thoughts? Yeah, I mean, I don't first, know, wait, man. Wait, 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 wait. First, have you ever seen the original <laughs> Exorcist movie? No. Shane, 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 Shane. 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 <laughs> uh, so you've don't never feel seen bad. You've Car- never seen, but you've never don't seen feel bad, Carbon. <laughs> you've never seen the original Exorcist movie, Orlando? Oh no, I, I seen it maybe. Gosh, I think maybe eight years ago. But like, I put it like this: I think it was the the second one. Um. It was so I always remember, man, because it's like my dad, you know, we was watching. I was, you know, young at the time. So I always remember it, it was something that like the devil took out of his mouth or something in one of the beginnings of it. It looked like an olive or something. And I remember one time we was outside walking here, the garden, and he was like, Don't step on that, because if you step on that, you'll fall straight to hell. So it was like whatever <laughs> I I never got past that first part of the movie. <laughs> so but you know, when I, you know, when wait, I got older. Carbon. Wait, let's go back to Carbon. Carbon, what look, tell us your thoughts, man. Um, it didn't really seem the most interesting to me. You know, I'm like, I, I don't know, man. I, the only thing I liked was the music. Music was the only thing that I really liked about it. Other than that, I'm like, it doesn't really seem it's going to be scary. You know, and I'm like... <laughs> Carbon? Yeah, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and give you a quick rundown of the extra. You ever seen a, a little white kid acting up in a store or something? Talking back to the mom? I mean, yeah, but that's not scary. Yeah, there's the whole movie for you. <laughs> the Exorcist? Yeah. You remember how she's talking? Linda Blair's have talking shit seen, to him? Have you, ever seen the, to the have you ever seen The Exorcist? He, he, I have. It's, like, it's, a it's joke, like a whole yeah. movie. Like a, yeah, I know, but there will be no, there will be no Exorcist <laughs> blasphemy on, on this podcast. This is one of the greatest <laughs> movies. I, I, I just gave it. Hey. Quick synopsis in the movie. Probably one of the greatest <laughs> movies ever made. <laughs> Yeah, especially when they throw that water and it's not snap. I see that in the store. They throw water on the child. It's not that's a whoa, whoa, whoa hold up now. <laughs> but all right, guys, we're gonna yeah. move on to the uh to the next uh topic. 